and Cecil levels up. Why? Because we defeated the CUP, CPU. And Edge leveled up, because we defeated the attacker and defender that went with it. And yes, that was the core of the Giant of Babel. So I suppose we better be getting out of here. Rosa, cast exit. Get us all out of here. Oh wait, I feel like I'm forgetting something. You. Hi, Clovis. How you doing, buddy? You met this guy before? Hmm? Okay. Our Lunarian is casting some funky magic. Ooh, wait, Fasuya, are you okay, man? Speaking of which... It looks like Gova has finally snapped out of his... control. Your father's name. Wait a minute! That means that... Gova's father... is the same father... As Cecil's? Is there any other bombshells you want to drop on us, Fosuya? Yeah, that was obvious, but next thing you're gonna tell me that Radia's father was Bahamut or something. So, the all-powerful Cecil and Gobez, Lunarians! And brothers! I know, that's messed up, man. Seriously. That's also messed up. So, Cecil says, no hard feelings. Let's work together. So that means we can be buddies, right? Zemus... Me and Zemus can't be buddies. He made me fight my own brother. Speaking of which... Oh no you don't. You ain't falling for that trap again. And Fosuya, in his infinite wisdom, Decides to join the magician. Hey guys, wait a minute. This isn't right. I feel like we should be helping them or something. Cecil? What are you waiting for? He's still in shock. Uh, speaking of shocks, isn't it about time we got you out of here? Seriously? Rosa? Exit! Kane! Kane, it looks like you snapped out of it. Let's talk. Hurry now. Alright. We'll talk later. Who knows the exit was so close? Regardless, since the core is defeated, that means the giant is defeated. And let's have a little talk about our Dunar Whale, where we have some privacy. Hey, Kane. Edge, Edge, cool it, man. Rosa? You would be the last one I expect to be saving Kane's butt. 
She's the glue that holds us together. Yeah, uh, Cecil was kind of shocked too. But hey, you know, since we have a uh, vehicle that can go to the moon, let's go ahead and go there. Oh, come on, Edge. What's the chance of it happening a third time? Pretty high, actually. Oh, did I say that loud? And so it's all agreed. We'll bust up Zemus and save the galaxy. Not just the planet, the galaxy once again. What? Are you serious, Cecil? We need magic power if we're going to beat Zemus. What is he thinking? Is he thinking we're gonna find Fulcia and Gobez there and form a party there? Dang, man. He's serious. Edge? That was cold, even from you. Regardless, I agree, Edge. The men shall go to the moon. But did we do the right thing? Yes, indeed. So it's us. The Paladin. The Dragoon. The Ninja. To the moon. To save the world once again. But first, we're gonna make a quick stop. Ah, uh, restroom break. Oh, yeah. Oh, Rosa? Wait a minute. Why are you on here? Yeah, we have that crystal over there. We can take you back anytime. Oh, isn't that sweet? <laughs> edge, edge, edge. You just don't get it, do you? Okay, seriously, we do need a white mage. We need somebody to heal our wounds, and Cecil ma Magic just isn't going to cut it alone. And Cecil, you can cover if needed. Not in that way. Aww. Wait a minute. <laughs> right here. Where were you hiding? Yeah, I suppose. We need some blasting power too. Edge's magic just isn't going to cut it. Hint, hint. And so, we have... Five party members, the Dragoon, the Paladin, or the White Mage, the Ninja, and the Summoner. This is our final party and will not change from this point on. But you can still go back to the moon and to the earth and back and forth as needed. When we go back to our next video, we shall be returning to the earth 
to finish up a brief side quest. But it's a very important one. Do you remember what it is? Magma WK, signing this PlayStation off. Play session off. And have a good night. And always take your women with you. And fly them to the moon, baby.